So I was just looking earlier and I realized it's been almost three weeks since I played Classic and I didn't really want to do that. That was not intentional, but with a new map and everything in Call of the Wild, I guess it was halfway expected, but we're actually back here in Pickabean Bay, which I know we hunted in one of the more recent Classic videos, but I wanted to see if I can actually work on a goal because there are like banners that go behind your profile in Classic and basically you unlock them with different achievements and the one that I want to get requires 100 harvests of every species in the game and I'm close on Bantang, I have 92 so I'm hoping we can maybe get that in this video or at least work towards it and Sambar Deer I think are the other species from this map that I need so if we can get some of those uh, along the way that would be just a huge bonus alright we're gonna have to take care of this guy I'm trying to figure out where this Bantang went like I had to have spooked it but that dude was gonna charge us so just get that taken care of but my hope is that we're going to have some like herds of Bantang or at least a couple traveling together because they move quite slowly and much like the water buffalo they have huge lungs so getting a shot on the run is quite doable and also this 9.3 is ridiculously overpowered but if we can figure out where this one went hopefully we can find some more with it okay that's not the one I was after, but that's what I'm looking for, so I do know the one I'm tracking is by itself, um, so if this is like two together, even better, and I definitely wouldn't mind spooking this one again, because it is not cooperating, but I think I'm tracking a female, and this was a male, so that might turn out being something decent. I don't think he is. They're not super easy to judge, but... He didn't look anything crazy special to me. Um, actually, he could be. Good weight and score. Looks like he's by himself. So we'll just take him there. I was going to try to stock up and maybe take him with a bow to not spook the one we're tracking, but since he actually has a chance of being good, figured I don't need to be tracking another one all around the entire map. And I would say like 150 is good for these and generally the higher scoring ones I've seen are like wider than that but I don't know one way to find out is weights not bad hey 151 you know what I'll take that um I think had I shot that with a muzzleloader and entered the competition for it that might have been first place because it was a weight comp and the highest weight was in the 700s but my luck I'd have not gotten 100% harvest value because I think that was a requirement yeah, first Bantang is going to be a pretty good one. Happy with that. And now, we'll go get back on that other one. And hopefully we can get these eight knocked out. If it takes as long to find the next seven as it did to take that one, I don't know. But we're going to try it anyway. Uh, hi. How you doing? I really hope this Bantang isn't close because... Once again, it's not like we have much of a choice. Just gonna take him out. I just had like a, a much more fresh track as well. So I don't know like exactly what it did. I still don't have a solid circle despite the uh, the more like recent time on the track. So I don't know. But uh, yeah, we'll take those bonus water buffalo as we go along ah, I see you over there gosh I can't believe I've tracked this female band tank for forever and it just refuses to ever be in sight I guess but that's over with what was that I think I think it was a water buffalo but uh yeah at least we have that down and uh we need six more now and I didn't even get the lungs, just got intestine, stomach, liver, but I'm actually going to go back to the lodge we started at, because number one, I wore like a, I forget what it's called, the heavier jacket thing, and my character's like breathing really hard and it's driving me insane, so we're going to put on something lighter, and I remember like a long time ago, hunting Bantang like down through this area, so we're going to give that a shot and see if there's more down here. What did that say? 
That's actually a nice pig. I hope I can get it. Um, it may be useful though <laughs> to actually use tracers. Oh boy. Uh, wait a minute. That's not fair. Where are you going? I want to get you. Please no. Speedy little bugger. <laughs> I don't know if that'll score over a thousand or not, but the max weight estimate will help because I forget how the scoring works on them, but weight and tusks is factored in. I would say he's going to be in the 900s. His tusks don't look that impressive. The weight's decent. Yeah, 980. I mean, not too bad. I did a mission. Cool. We'll take those. Okay, so that's a female. I had a call from a male roughly in the same area. So I said earlier, like, if I could get groups of them, it should be quite doable to actually get two. Uh, although having two rounds loaded would be nice. So there's got to be a male over here. And, like, generally they'll travel in the same direction if they are together. So... I'm going to try to take my time and see if I can figure out where the male is. But the good thing is I'll have his track, so if I can't actually see him, I should be able to follow him. Actually, I might be able to just go get her with a crossbow, too. Especially if she's just going to walk basically right to me. I'm going to just scoot over here a little bit. Now, hopefully he didn't hear that. I don't know where he was. I just saw... A hog take off and that could very well spook him still gonna take my time moving around though because if he's anywhere like up this way probably he didn't hear that but that's three and I was actually on a different track before I got the call from the mail so I do think down uh, in this area south of the river is probably a good place for them but hopefully They'll cooperate down here a little better than they did uh, over where we were before. Ooh, hello there. That's why I couldn't see you. Wait, who said that? New trail female. This could be interesting. And I see one over there. Okay. Uh, How far is he? He's... Get where I can see a little better. About 34 now. If I cannot spook that female that's behind him, you know, after I stand here and reload, we might be able to get all three of these because that other one's just chilling there. I could probably get it. Can't see super well, but... All right. I didn't hear any footsteps. I can't see it, but I don't think it ran. Hold up. There's two there. Okay. Um. I don't really know what to do here, but. Maybe I'll just kind of scoot over there and see if I can get the two of them. Because that could have been the other female I heard. I really don't know now. But this is a, a much lower scoring male than what we had earlier. That guy's just a 128. Hey, no, 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 no. That's not, that's not what I wanted to happen. Wait, where are they all coming from? Because I just saw one... Yeah, over there to my left. Uh, she's there everywhere. I don't know which one to shoot. Like I said, 9.3 massively overpowered. So I think we have six down? Wouldn't mind throwing a seventh shot at one somewhere, but... Looks like we found the spot. I think we ought to be good to get to 100 Bantang, and that was like the ultimate goal here, so... As long as we can follow... There were at least two more that got away, I think. As long as we can follow them, we ought to be set. But yeah, that was the secret, like, uh... Just coming down here to the south. Ooh. That was a Texas heart shot, too. But, uh... Right, like, along the mountains here. That's where I'm running into all of them, so... If you're interested... Maybe a good place to check out. I can see at least one there. I don't know if there's any others. I mean, I think probably the best thing is to try to take them like while we can see them. Because at least I'm not having any struggles tracking them down here. And I think that's mainly because like what was happening earlier was 
I found a track and then I ran into the buffalo and I, I would spook it like a couple of times and it running around and then into the water, which was the other issue, is what was throwing me off. Because what happens is essentially they'll run down into the water and then they'll kind of like bounce back. So they'll hit like a, a spot of water that's too deep to cross and then they run back the other way. And all of that stuff was what was like slowing things down. So I think we're fine to, to use the gun and then I think we just need one more after this if I counted right. That was a mail? <laughs> I didn't even realize that. 104. Okay. I did have a mail track. I was kind of hopeful that it might be something. I bet it was that one because it was a low weight. But yeah. Hopefully... We got some fresh trotting and stuff here. Hopefully we can find one more. Ooh. That might be something. Alright. Before he moves because he is in a spot where a few more steps will make the shot a lot more difficult. I shot a little bit high, but that should be okay. I don't actually know if that's going to kill him. I hope it does. I try to do, like, there's a thing where you can essentially walk and your gun is steadied, but as I walk forward, it lifted my shot a little bit. I hope that kills him. That might have been bigger than the other one we got. Oh, yeah. We got into the, the top of the near side lung, so I think he's actually down right there. Is that what that is? Yeah, cool. So he's like a different, um, a different fur type. He's, I don't know what they're called, dark or almost like a chocolate color. But his weight's kind of low. I had his track. I didn't really think anything of it. I think he's got a chance of beating the other one anyway. Weight's in the right kind of area. Yeah, he's 155. That actually is pretty much right at my personal best. And that's a heck of a one to get for the 100th Bantang achievement. So... We'll get a little trophy shot set up here. And honestly, like, this fur color looks a lot cooler to me than, like, the sort of bright orange we had with the other one. So, I think that's pretty good. That was, uh, that was good. I mean, we started off strong, got a really good ending. I don't think I could ask for a whole lot more for a hunt like this. So, yeah, I think that's going to do it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.